Hi guys, Patty from CC and Patsy's Boutique. Um, happy Monday. I am currently working on my son's dining chairs and while they're in the drying process right now, I'll show you what project I decided to start next. If you've been following me, I picked these up last week when I was out and about hitting all the sales and some thrifting. Um, so I picked up these beautiful, look at these, I don't know if you can see all those details. Look at this, look at these. Aren't these fabulous? I love these. And they're nice ceramic, really thick, solid, and they're they're pretty heavy. And they're a good size too. So I got this one that I haven't started yet. And I have this one, if you can see it right here. Um, so I'm going to tell you what I've done so far. Because uh, I was a little anxious this morning. So we did two coats of black chalk paint. And I let that dry up. And I just applied a coat of Wiesel's Dark Star Glaze. Um, glazes, the fun thing about glazes, and often they will act as a, a seal coat. So now my black, two coats of black chalk paint are protected with this lovely seal coat of Dark Star uh, Glaze that I went over. And once this is all dry, I'm going to start going into all these beautiful details and hit them with some beautiful metallics, bright, vibrant metallics. Maybe do some gold leafing and then give her a good seal and she'll, this one will be ready. And I believe I'm going to do them as a set so that they'll actually be a matching set. Um, I'm not quite sure, but I think that's where I'm going. I think we're definitely going with a matching set. But that's where we're at so far. So I'm going to hit this with the flash dryer. You remember I told you about craft dryers. I'm going to hit this with the flash dryer and then we'll be back for the next steps. Stay tuned. Hi guys. Hello, hello, hello. I'm back. So when I left you, we were going to hit it with the dryer so that we can get it all ready for the next steps. And as you can see, I already started. So I started with adding some metallics. Let me show you what I'm using for my metallics. Remember, use what you have on hand and make sure you're doing you, you know, make it all about what you like. Okay. So here's the metallics. I have, they're by Art Alchemy Metallic. This one is Royal Red. That's a vibrant one. You can see it on there. Isn't that pretty? And then uh, we have this beautiful purple iris, iris potion. Isn't that gorgeous? Look, there it is on there. Isn't that so pretty? And I've used Ginger Magic again by Art Alchemy. That's a pretty color. Look at, isn't that pretty? And then we also added in some, let me see. Emerald green. It looks more kind of like a teal to me. But when it goes on, there it is. Isn't that gorgeous? I got it up here. So as you can see now, this is the fun part because there's a lot of details. So of course, you're going to be using your small, fine detail brushes to get all in there. Now here's what I'm thinking. I think I may do the teeth area with gold leafing um, and maybe around the eyes with some gold leafing. I don't know. Or maybe just more colors because I have more metallics. So we have this lighter blue. Um, it's called Magical Pond. So maybe I'll use some of that. We also have... Fairy Wings, which is a really cool looking green. And then we have Dragon's Eye. That might be really cool on here. Maybe I'll use that around the eyes. That would be super, 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 super cool. Um, And here's another one. It's called Deep Waters. Now look at that blue. That is gorgeous. So that's where we're at. And I'm going to give it a little spin for you. So you can see all the details I've done so far. I may even add some of uh, my waxes to this. I don't know yet. She's just been talking to me as we go. But look at all these details. Isn't this gorgeous? 
So if you remember, we did two coats of black chalk paint. Then I went over that with Wise Al's Dark Star Glaze. And now I am adding all my metallics. to all these beautiful details because, well, it just needs to be really wham, bam in your face. You know what I mean? So here's where we're at. Um, again, I got these, I believe at Michael's. They looked like that. They, can, they just come solid white ceramic. They're pretty good size um, and full of details and they're pretty heavy. So they're very sturdy and they're nice and thick. And like I said, this is where I'm at. I don't know what to do on the inside. On the inside, I'm really feeling like maybe it needs something metallic, um, maybe like a gold on the inside. And I was thinking putting little fairy lights up there so it, it twinkles. I don't know. I don't know about that. We'll see. But that's where we're at. And like I said, this is, I'm sorry, I keep spinning the table. Um, this is where I'm at so far. So, uh, yeah, I am going to post this video in a few minutes. Um, and you guys can let me know what you think. Uh, gold leafing, or should I use the, the dragon's eye gold? Um, and what do you think on the inside? Should I go black? with the dark star glaze or should I make it a different color in there to make it pop? So you guys tell me in the comments and let me know what you think. But I am so, 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 so loving this. This is fabulous. Oh, and the butterfly. I haven't gotten to it yet, but look at that. I'm just, I'm blown away. So yeah, let me know in the comments. And um, again, happy Monday. Hope you guys are having a fabulous day. And I will talk to you guys real soon. Bye-bye.